This is my makeup for today. I used the Juvia's Place, the Magic Palette. And it's a really pretty palette. I haven't used Juvia's Place in a while. But that is what the palette looks like. It's really pretty. So that's what I have on my eyes today. And for my foundation today, I have on the CoverGirl and Olay Simply Angels foundation. I really, really love this. I also have a little bit of the L'Oreal Infallible Powder Foundation on top, but just a very tiny bit. But yeah, that's how my base looks today. I also used the L'Oreal Lumi Bronze It Bronzer. This is such a nice bronzer. I really love it. It's like a perfect color for me. But yeah, that's my makeup. And I just have some ColourPop Lux. I also have some ColourPop Luxe Gloss on in the shade called Come Through. So that is my makeup for today. And I really like how it turned out. So yeah. I have my hair in a bun. I'm, I'm tr I never wear my hair up, so I'm trying to wear my hair up more. <laughs> but yeah, that's my makeup for today. A pile of swimsuits I'm getting rid of. And then... The bags of clothes I'm getting rid of. So you guys probably know that a lot of my clothes are from Dressily and Rose Gal because I've worked with them many times in the past. They would contact me and ask me to pick out clothes in exchange for YouTube videos, which is awesome. But I'm kind of over Dressily and Rose Gal. I want to expand my wardrobe with different things, not all the same thing like I want to do like Target, Walmart, Kohl's, Old Navy, Torrid, Forever 21. Anywhere that has cute plus size clothing that are somewhat affordable. Because I feel like all my like try on hauls are from Rose Gal and Dress Italy. And you know, I want to do videos on clothing that is more accessible for everyone. 